Good evening, I'm Derek Bain. Brittany Hardaway has the night off. Our top story tonight, a program taking a proactive step toward addressing youth-related violence in Ogle County. It's called Handle with Care. It's the same type of program that Rockford Public Schools and the Rockford Police Department agreed to back in April of 2022. And here's how it's going to work in Ogle County. If a student is involved in an incident in which the Sheriff's Department is called to the scene, the Sheriff's Department will email that student's school administrators. The email will not say what happened. Instead, it'll just read the student's name and the title Handle with Care. From there, schools can provide accommodations to the student, like speaking with a guidance counselor. The goal, to give students some grace and teachers a heads up when a student may have dealt with a potentially violent incident. As 13 WREX's Shannon Taylor reports, this program is also helping fill the necessary gaps for two local districts, ensuring the need for extra safety for students. According to the Ogle County Sheriff's Department, approximately 80% of domestic dispute calls police respond to involve a juvenile in the house. One of the main driving points the county had for launching Handle with Care. While this comes as a huge win for schools in Ogle County, all 10 districts are now getting the help they need when it comes to keeping students safe. This is just a, a program that um, you know, we felt would help facilitate those areas that you know, don't have the ability to have school resource officers. Right now, both Rochelle and Oregon school districts currently have a resource officer on campus, while Byron and Meridian school districts have a sheriff office deputies in the schools to assist students, should they receive a handle with care email. Ogle County Sheriff Brian Van Vickle tells me more rural areas like Creston School District, along with the City of Polo School District, currently don't have police resource officers at their schools, but are looking forward to the collaboration with the Sheriff's Department to making sure that all students are handled with care. Our email goes directly to our school counselors. Um, so that email is then given to whichever building needs it. And um, those school counselors meet with that child right away in the morning and check in with them. Mongel says in the past, they have reached out to the Polo Police Department if an incident occurred with multiple outreach counseling services on standby. IRIS program through the Regional Office of Education, and that's another way that we can hook them up with services. We also have Synesthipi that um, comes in to our school. But is looking forward to having one extra layer of protection for students as they go through life's changes. In Ogle County, Shannon Taylor, 13 WREX. Sheriff Van Vickle says although the Sheriff's Department is overseeing the program, police departments in Ogle County have also been provided all the information on Handle with Care to implement on their own.